we got all the parts back now for the rear end from the uh, painters. Now we didn't powder coat these, we had them painted because we've got a guy here local that does a really good job with some industrial paint. And so uh, we've got the rear end now set down in place and uh, we've got our trailing arms. These are new trailing arms and uh, so we're going to go ahead and start putting this thing back together now. And the goal here is to get this thing to where it's on four wheels so we can get on to the next step. This is some um, silicone that we're going to put on these bushings here to keep them from squeaking. That's being a little stubborn. All you need is a bigger hammer. Plenty of silicone on here so we don't have any squeaking going on. Plus this helps preserve that rubber from drying out. The trick to this is getting this cup down in there right. jack stands that the rear end is on are as low as they'll go. So I'm just bringing the trailing arms up to where the rear end is instead of lowering the rear end down to the trail arms. Okay, next step we're going to go ahead and put these U-bolts through and bolt the axle to the trailing arm. You can see right here, I welded a little bracket on there for the emergency brake cable. Once this thing is on four wheels, I'll go back and torque all these down. I don't like doing that while it's up on jack stands. Next thing we're going to do is put the pan hard bar in there. 
and I got plenty of silicone on it. Okay, the bar is mounted in there. Now we just have to adjust the ball joint on the end here. And we want to make sure this thing is right now the there's no weight to speak of on here, so it's pretty well lined up like it's supposed to. So we just want to make sure and we tighten this down that it's not pulling the rear end one way or the other. And it looks like it is and it's in there pretty good. Okay, I've got the brake disc back on there. I've got one nut holding it on. Next thing we'll do is go ahead and bolt the caliper on. Last thing, we'll go ahead and put the wheel on. a roller.